Hello, it's Ruby and today I am going back to university. So I am starting my second year at Exeter today and I am excited. I am excited. I'm feeling more excited than I did last week, but um, I'm also a tiny bit apprehensive. You see, it's been a very long summer and I think it's natural to kind of just be a little bit nervous for, for adjusting to university life again. But I am looking forward to it and I'm sharing a house with friends this year, which should be really lovely. So we're leaving in about an hour and I've just had my timetable come through so I'm just going to go through my calendar and add this in because it's very useful to have your lectures always in your calendar. This year we hired a van to go up to Exeter and that was because my mum was using the car for work and otherwise she wouldn't have been able to get to work and it actually worked out really well because we had so much more space. As you can see, I did bring a lot. Lipstick mark. Oh, no, it hasn't shown. <laughs> that's good, that's good. Gonna miss you. I'm gonna miss you. Yeah. How is it that a four month summer could have gone so quickly? 120 days. I'm gonna miss her galloping down the stairs in the morning. <laughs> Mum actually just recorded a video of me walking down the stairs because she likes the way I sound when I walk downstairs. Oh, and look at Lola. Lola. I'm gonna miss you! I'm gonna miss you! And then we had the long drive to Exeter. It was raining on the way, which was so lovely. I love the rain. And we ate these amazing samosas. And I got this tapped water. It's birch water, which is tapped from a tree. And it's amazing. Honestly, my new favorite drink. As oh an gosh, idea, that's the pie, just as Dutch shoulders. It's literally like, it's so unique, it's, it's a tiny bit coconutty, but not. Um, like, nutty, it's nutty. Real. Real. So then we got to the house. And I put on a time lapse of me getting everything put away, but when my dad opened the window, it fell over, and so I didn't realise, but I didn't actually record any of it. Okay, so I'm in my new room. This is what it looks like. It's obviously very messy at the moment, but it's such a nice size, and I'm just basically starting to get this put up, I am going to put this on time lapse. But I did do some time lapses later on, so I just put all of my clothes away in my wardrobe and the wardrobe is so, so spacious. I was not expecting for the wardrobe to be this big. I don't just store my clothes here, I can store my cleaning supplies and my university stuff, like there's just so much space. And at the same time, my dad very kindly got the bed made up. After that, we left to go to Dunelm because basically we had bought the wrong size sheet for the bed and we needed to go and grab one. And after that, we went to just get my fresh food, so just some fruit and vegetables. And we also went out for dinner, which was very nice.
my room is still not quite there and I think I might do a tiny bit tidying now get into my pyjamas first and then have a go at tidying up a little bit putting a few bits away so that I can sleep soundly my dad just left um, and if I'm, gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna be super honest with you and say I honestly hate the moment that he leaves even after a year of being at university I still really don't like the moment where I have to say goodbye okay so I'm now in my pajamas and I'm ready to go to bed um, I love my bed set up this is actually a scarf but it works really well as a blanket and I really wanted a tartan autumnal blanket for the end of my bed and there was no point going out and buying one I just decided to use the scarf Thank you for watching this video and I hope that you have a productive week. Bye.